and the freezing weather, the city has been able to get many migrants off the streets and into emergency shelters during this weather. And one Denver church has opened its doors for migrant families. Denver 7's Brandon Richard shows us just why they wanted to help. Like many families fleeing the economic crisis in Venezuela, this family is seeking a better life. We wanted to come here because uh, to the United States because we want to work, we want to have a house. We didn't have a house in Venezuela. We couldn't work in Venezuela. The children also couldn't go to school. We want them to be able to study. They're going to be the first like generation that will be able to study. After arriving in Colorado, they were able to get an apartment. One room apartment with me and my three kids, and then my sister came. Uh, there were eight of us in there, but the apartment I was um, all renting for five people. Unable to find reliable jobs to pay the rent, they were evicted with no place to go amid sub-zero temperatures. And so when I got wind of this, um, they said, could you come pick us up? So last night I made a run to go pick them up. Pastor Keith Reeser brought them to his church. Since last week, Denver Friends Church has been operating this emergency overnight shelter to help migrants escape the cold. People are able to come in, they're able to get uh, food. Uh, we have a meal that's provided for them. A little bit of normalcy and a, a warm spot to sleep each night. The city says the number of migrants arriving to Denver has dropped in recent days, likely due to the cold weather. But numbers are expected to go back up, which is why the city says Mayor Mike Johnston is in Washington, D.C. this week to urge federal officials to provide more support. The city says the mayor will meet with White House and administration officials, members of Congress, and fellow mayors to pursue solutions that will help manage this crisis. Back in Denver. So our goal is just any time that the temperature hits 32 or below, where our hope is to be open. Pastor Rees says his church will continue doing its part to support families like this one. They are simply trying to survive and trying to start a new life. In Denver, Brandon Richard, Denver 7. And Denver Friends Church says they're able to accommodate 29 people each night. They also say they've received so many donations that right now at least they no longer need any, but they could use volunteers to staff the shelter overnight. So if you're interested, you can give their office a call at 303-455-7604.